Good morning, guys. Oh my god. Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to another vlog. Um, big shot. I'm gonna sneeze. No, I'm not. I've missed it again. I always fucking leave my sneeze. It's getting me angry. I'm giving Sully realness this morning off Monsters Inc. Club. Blue shorts, purple hoodie. Someone has just looked through my window and seen me do that. Also, guys, I've just seen two old people doing a paper round and it's actually made me so sad. Um, it's made me actually want to read the newspaper. This morning, somebody by my house drove through someone else's house. What the fuck? But I just thought, I literally only stopped vlogging yesterday and posted yesterday. It's now Friday. Just thought, we could spend a few days together. You know, I love to do that. I don't even care if anyone watches, I like to look click back. But the plan for today is I'm going to go meet Byron. I'm going to film a say it or shot it for my channel and potentially something for Byron's channel. And that is the plan. I'm going to have a meet around Manchester and go back to Billy's. I never actually open PR on camera. I'm going to do it. Okay. Oh. So I was sent some stuff by Neon the minute you open the box. I smell it. I can smell it. What have I got here? I seen the DPD man. I was like, bring me a present. Perfect night's sleep. Magnesium bath milk. English lavender. Chamomile and patchouli. Mm. I smell this. I could do with a good night's sleep. <laughs> Do you know the thing about Neon? Neon, Neon. Love them so much. It's just so very like, <sighs> it smells so very pharmaceutical, but it's nice. You just gotta get used to it, okay. Oh, then we've got something from Coco and Eve, like a virgin. Microfiber, her towel wrap. Slay the world, I guess, so that's cute. Moondrop Dreams from Bird and Blend, Tico, Colin All Spurs, Cadets, Dewey, Lemon and Lavender, perfect for snoozing. Some little tea. Oh my god, is this a, is this a speaker? Is this a speaker for the bath? What? That's quite iconic. And I think this is the thing you put the tea in and drop it in your, I actually needed one of these because I got some um, green tea, temp from China. And it's like proper green tea and you need to use that and I didn't have that. Then they sent me a little candle, also called Perfect Night Sleep. It's just very strong and I'm very much still half sleep, so maybe that's why. And then, I don't know, these are some like leaves. And then we've got Pillow Mist. Love, love, love Pillow Mist. Just thought I'd show you that, not that anyone cares, but how cute. Thanks, Neon. So, bit of an update for you all. I'm now walking to the train station. I say it all the time, but I'm literally dripping in sweat. I've got a hoodie in my bag. I'm not really sure why I brought a hoodie, to be honest, because I'm going to take a rough guess and say in this weather I'm not going to need it. But I've got my big bag because I've got to bring things to Manchester because filming, I don't know if I mentioned this, probably did. I say it or shot it with Byron for Sunday's video. So I have a full bottle of tequila in my bag. I live in the smallest town ever, so I am getting looked at like I'm an absolute freak of nature for holding this camera. So I'm gonna go. I decided <coughs> whilst I wait for Byron, I'm actually gonna sit and have a coffee. Because it is genuinely so hot out. Yeah, it's had it on the way, so that means I'll probably be in like an hour. But until then. Shot every time I say it, it's absolutely sweating. But I'm with Byron now. He's gonna go and get his ear pierced. Are you gonna ear me up here? Loads of little, but yeah. So we're in Affleck, so why Byron gets that done. We'll see what happens. Yeah. So we've been very impulsive. Byron is now in there getting two ear piercings, and I've decided I'm gonna get one. I'm gonna get like up here done, up here. I don't need to put earrings back in my two clothes. I've been saying I'm going to do it for ages, but what are we actually doing? We've just left now. Byron has had his ear pierced. He hates it. I don't hate the pierce. I just hate just the, hit the earring that I chose. And I feel like 
I had this done, I'm not really quite sure why. <laughs> I did just say to Byron, there is a high chance that next time you see me, I will actually have no earring in, including the one that I just got pierced. I'm an absolute sheep. I did it for moral you support. I wanted to get involved. But yeah, so high chance you'll be seeing me with this for all of a week maybe. And then it will be out. What is on my camera? <sighs> Good morning everyone. As he sang it once said, it's a new dawn, it's a new day and I'm feeling good. So unnecessary. Anyway, um, I feel like... Oh! I actually didn't catch up with you yesterday. After we'd been out in Manchester, um, we went back to Byron's and filmed a say it or shot it. It will already be on my channel if you want to go and watch it. The fun vid. And then we chill for a bit and I come home. I have the worst sweaty chub rub ever. So my mum's had to give me some soda cream. It doesn't feel as bad today. My skin literally swelled up, swollen, become swollen. I don't know, whatever the right terminology is. But today, I'm actually going to go out for some tea with Billy later on. But first, we're going to take my niece and nephew to the fun fair. They've never actually been off the top of my head, I don't think. So I'm actually really excited to do that. But I'm just going to get ready first and then I'll check back in with you guys when I'm done. I've actually just received a bit of PR, so we can sit and open it together. Let's do that. I've swapped out of my lovely towel into my dressing gown because I am awfully scared of you guys seeing something you really don't want to see. Now, let's get into it. It's a big box. Honestly, no idea what it is. Oh, it's from Space and One of my favourite places ever. Hey Callum, we're so excited to have you part of, as part of our community. We wanted to send you some of our skincare heroes. Tag us at Space and Care and let us know what you think. Oh my god, I've actually been waiting to try this for ages. I was actually watching a TikToker that like goes to cosmopolitan school. Cosmopology school. Cosm I don't know. Where you learn skincare and facials and things like that. And they do like um, what your skincare says about you. And they actually pop this up on screen and said it says you've got basically really nice skin and you're cool. So not that that. <laughs> Why am I rambling so much? But yeah. So I got there. Then we got Drunk Elephant Maritinol Oil. Maritinol. Me Retinol. Ma Retinol. Clear and smooth. Then we have Ultraviolet SPF 50 liquid. I actually have the spray of that behind me also from Space and Care. The Pharmacet Green Clean Makeup Melt Away Balm. And this actually won Best of Beauty a lot 2017. Fresh. I've actually wanted to try fresh skincare for a while, so I'm excited to try this. It is the T Elixir Skin Resilience Activating Serum. So yeah, thank you very much Space and Care, appreciate it as always, and I love you all so much. Now guys, I'm actually going to go and get ready and then I'll check in with you when I'm done. Right. Where are we going guys? To the gala. We're going to the galas. Mm -hmm. Chester, are you going to say hello? No, Arca. Speak to the Arca. 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 What's this one no, called? No, 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 no. What's its name? What are you laughing at? The whale. The whale. It's not a sperm whale. It is not a sperm whale. It is. It is. Look at my. It's not a whale. It's just a whale. No bear whale. You are Chester. No, no, me. What's your name then? Chester. 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 So where are we going, Sophia? What are you going to do at the galas? Play. Play? Are you excited? Yeah. I'm lying on your lap. You're lying on my lap? I'm on your lap. Are you excited for the gala? Fucking buzzing. We just can't wait for the gala. It's actually rampant. <laughs> <laughs> it's absolutely rampant. <laughs> it really is. It's bad luck. Like, we've well, had just live for stuff like this. Yeah, they actually do. It's giving. It's dying for this dinner. It's giving midsummer. Is that what it's called? <laughs> uh, 
It's giving chaotic. But yeah, it's basically like witnesses cream fields. <laughs> um, so we just can't wait, but we've actually had to come for Red Bull first because if I've got to deal with that many children in one day. It's not even the children to be honest. I mean, I'm making kids look left and right on a absolutely yeah. empty road. So we've actually just parked and my nan's on the road. Is it dead? Not a car in sight. And my nan has stopped to teach Chester and Sophia how to look left and right before they cross the road. They're literally three, bless her. It's got a bit of a air con in the shop. I know I've complained about this like a thousand times about how hot it is in the UK, but I'm sick to death of this rock. Oh, it's not really showing it, is it? The top is literally so okay. I can't wait for winter. I was saying this with Anna the other day. I can't wait for winter to be like in a hood and like calls out with a candle and watch the film. Fucking sick of it. Why are you doing that? What are you doing? We're just here at the gala, everyone. Woo! You wanted to just see my nephew, it's the funniest thing ever. I actually thought he was down the thing on the room. Because the one wouldn't let her on. He's so iconic. <laughs> Sophia, what are you on? Oh, bye! Chester! Say hi to my vlog, Gran. Hello, love. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. Are you enjoying your day? I am now, I'm with you, love. Oh, Nan, you look so beautiful. Guys, this is my Nan, and she is one of my favourite people in the entire world. I just, it's I, mad, I, isn't it? What do you think? I don't. <laughs> I just love you. Thank you. <laughs> That's me told. That was a lovely little afternoon. I don't know if you can hear in the background, but it's never really the easiest thing ever to leave a fun fair with children. But we've managed it by bribing them with presents, what can I say? I don't know if I would put it in, but we just did hook a duck to get them snakes and they love them. So hopefully that will satisfy them until we get back to my aunt's. But I think we're just gonna head back there now, have a drink, have a chill. And then I actually need to go back and get ready for day night tonight, which should be fun. Me and Kelly actually ended up getting the cut, so I got this one. It says, no, if you hang up, and then Kelly got the mental breakdown one, but hers is actually a little bit deep, so... It's a bit, yeah, it is a bit serious. Yeah, it's a bit serious. Go on. Obviously I just got back on my face and this is a bit... A bit concerned. Well, yeah. What? Not me. What are you pointing at? No, not me. Should I do it to me? Why is it when you're like doing nothing that you get the most tired? Should be rejuvenated. Okay, girlies. So I've actually been back at my house for a while now. Um, I filmed a little get ready with me so that I'll either be on TikTok or Instagram by the time you're watching this. I'm going to edit it on the train down to Billy's because I'm actually going to get the train there. Do I look a bit green? I want to show. I'm going to get the train to Billy's and then he's going to pick me up before we go for dinner. Yeah. So. That's the plan of attack, and yesterday when me and Byron got our ears pierced, I'm not going to say a word, I don't know if you've even seen that, but she's, like, Byron's still bleeding. It's been, like, 30 hours, and mine is so bruised. Like, surely that isn't normal. Anyways, um, yeah, see you on the train, or at Billy's, I don't know, but I'll see you soon. So, I've met Billy now. I was wondering why it's going the wrong way. I've met Billy now, he's just putting petrol in and then we're going to head for some food. We're going to an Italian, I don't know if we mentioned that we're going to an Italian. I definitely said we were going to food. Anyway, my current obsession, I've probably said this as well, is bruschetta. I could actually live off it, like, it's becoming a sick drug. It used to be tequila, was the thing I used to be known for. Billy's mum used to call me tequila boy, now she calls me bruschetta boy. There's Billy. It's getting really bad, but I mean, at least it's vegetables. Also, I forgot to mention, last night at 2am, I was going to say Billy's, I didn't, I ended up going home because I had chub rub, but that man, Billy goes to sleep so early, and he always turns the light off at like half nine. I feel suffocated with it. I don't like it. Anyway, because I stayed on my own last night, I didn't. I was up till like half two with the light on. Woo! God. Um listening to in my airpods on full blast 
Cheryl Cole fight for this love. That was before it's time. Like, that is actually a banger. I used to joke about it, but what is it? The words. Anything worth fighting for. Oh, anything could happen. If it's a. Uh, uh, mm, oh, we've got to fight, 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 fight. So, yeah. Bit random. Just thought I'd inform you on that. And if you've not listened to it recently, go and listen to it. Hear the music. What? Hear the music. You look happy. Only considerable pain. Hi, bro. Just out of nowhere. What? Do you want a mini fan? Go for something like that. Is that what? It's a bit deep. Mm -hmm. Well, guys, that was not good. Oh, the lighting's significantly better here. I didn't die, though, so. Nope, you're still here, alive and kicking. Unfortunately. So, I've come to the bathroom really quick to speak to you, but can you agree, right? I needed to say it away, it's on my mind, because I was just saying it to be left. On top of um, I get the worst small town anxiety ever. Like, if I was just, I feel anxious like this up here. If I was in Manchester, I just wouldn't care. I actually get the worst anxiety in small towns ever. I feel like they're the most judgmental places ever. I've got a bit of sauce going on this kit, like. Anyways, what's the difference between me and Villa? You're a that. Oh, I never. What's the word? This is just such a gorgeous background. So, I didn't pick up my camera last night and I actually haven't today. As soon as we got back from having food last night, I literally just started editing my video and was up till 3 am until it was done. But, that went up today. It's a fun video, so if you want to go and watch it, please. <coughs> <laughs> Please do. Uh, but I am now just sat with Lacey. <laughs> and we're actually sat sorting out all of my makeup. Lacey does makeup as well. So I was like, do you want to come round and help me sort everything out? Because I just know I can palm so much stuff off on her and she'll take it. <laughs> so we're currently just going through my bronzers, but. What I'll do is when we're fully done, I think I'll come back and show you everything actually organised for once. Because I don't think I've ever shown through my makeup drawers, but so many people ask to see it. But I never want to show it because it's embarrassing. But maybe today will be that day. I always knew I had a problem with blusher. <laughs> but I think this is actually quite unnecessary. Like, who in life needs this much blush? Me. <laughs> <laughs> Lacey's like giddy, like ah. <laughs> oh god, this is gonna be a hard one because I actually don't want to get rid of Anna, but it needs to happen. Small change in scenery. We're in the car. Um, we're gonna actually go for a milkshake or something, just a nice drink. We've been we literally went out for a nice drink before and didn't get one. All you want in life is liquids. Oh, liquids, good liquids. Good liquids. Nice drink over nice food any day. 100%. Mm, I mean, I mm. do like both, but I do love a nice drink. Where are we going? That way. Okay. Let's go. Good songs, good vibes. Where are we going? What's the drink of trees? <laughs> Which, a Negroni. Mm. Um, <laughs> we come early when they literally have nothing to on back here. Do you know where I am? That thing you wanted before. Yeah. Hi, could I have a caramel iced frappe, please? Yeah, I can go for you. Could I please have um, a large Coke Zero with ice? Yeah. And a regular vanilla milkshake? Uh, we currently don't have any milkshakes, so I'm really sorry. <laughs> um, ah. Should we cancel yours? <laughs> no, we can't do that again. Um, uh, oh, God. Sorry. It's alright. Uh, I really don't know what to do. I'm panicking, I'm sure. Can I have some mozzarella dippers? Please? Yeah, do you want the side or the server? Uh, the side, please. Any you for you? That's everything, thank you. Yeah, just see you next window when you're here, please. Thanks, Sean. <laughs> Oh. Do you know what's meant to be good? A vanilla milkshake with a shot of coffee in. Yeah. yeah. I get that from Starbucks. I get an ice vanilla. Uh, I get a vanilla bean frappuccino with no whipped cream. I, you know this? I've like, had it with you. Yeah. And then I put espresso in it and caramel drizzle. We love that. We love that. 
I'm for you, man. <laughs> Why? Because I don't want this now. Why? Because you're not getting nothing. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've got a large cork and mozzie dips. Fair enough. Hi, is the uh, the Yes, please. Well, that, that'll reach on it. Rich. Thank you. Thanks. Got to wear a bit of channel bank balance after that. <laughs> guys, we'll be back after I had a breakdown. So, guys. Maybe let's not put our camera on there, hey? I'm um, honestly, apologies that you saw zoomed in. I'm back home now. Somebody rang Glacy and then she, by the way, it's the floor. I'm not farting. Just so you know, if it creaks, you saw zoomed in because I am, in fact, nude. But just wanted a quick catch up with you guys before I end the vlog. I just want to say why I ended the last part. So, but like, anyway, also, if you're ever in the Canary Islands, whenever I go, I buy like several tubs of this. I think I bought, brought four home with me last time. Set aloe vera body cream. This one. Could I get it online? Probably. I need to check that. What was I going to say? Yeah. I actually can't believe it's the end of the weekend already. It sounds so stupid because obviously I don't have like a set work schedule through the week. Like I don't obviously go to work, do a 9 to 5, things like that. Like my boyfriend does, family does, etc. But I actually do get like a bit bummed out at the end of the weekend because I don't know if you will have seen in the video I posted last with Byron they say I'll show you we was on about like the job and it's saying it's like a lonely job so when it comes to the weekend I still get like a weekend feeling so I'm like oh I'm so out of breath I'm like oh I get to spend the weekend with my boyfriend and my family blah 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 so by the time it comes round to end I do I just get very like hmm it's over again but yeah what much transfer do you want? I can all the behind me as well, guys. I actually really need to replace that. I've been saying I'm going to replace it for absolutely ages. Where's my moisturizer in here? Oh, that is not my moisturizer. Back actually on the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream. I used to use this when I was like 16, but I just stopped using it then for some reason. And then Kiehl's actually sent it me. I forgot how good it was. And now I'm back on it. Also, back to the gym tomorrow, full time. I know I keep saying it. But I've held myself accountable with YouTube, I've done it, I have been consistent to the best of my ability and now it's time for me to do the same in the gym because honestly, I feel disgusting. I feel like I'm out of breath at every given moment. I feel so like a few months ago when I'd just done the 75 days hard, I would have let this camera be zoomed out. Not right now, baby girl. Not right now. But anyway, that's a chat for another video. I have said to myself, I promise that next summer I'm going to have a sick bod and I'm going to be gorgina and actually enjoy myself and not be self conscious. So we'll see about that. Anyway, I'm rambling. I'm literally knocking myself for looking at myself. I need to sort myself. But yeah, so spin at 10am. You'll see it in next week's vlog, I'm sure. Um, or at least me like go in before after whatever but my camera's gonna die so I'm gonna love and leave you all thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed the video be sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe wow I actually never say that god it's getting to a point anyway yeah if you did enjoy it please do subscribe and I shall see you all in the next one bye